Tin and dope. Let's support the pawn. Let's bring the bishop out. Preventing the knight from jumping here for the fried liver. Let's develop the knight attacking the pawn and castle. Open up the white square bishop. Take the pawn off. And tempting to just bring the bishop here because I like that position, but I believe the pawn is just going to drop and fork. So we may as well go with this position for this opening here. I'm going to attack the knight, x-raying through to the queen. If they forget themselves, we'll get the queen with the bishop. They haven't done, just going to simplify and take and take. Not overthinking that situation. Really want to push to the head of the snake, but I'm going to resist. I'm just going to develop the rook. Obviously, we know they'll be looking for the cheap here, bringing the queen across here. So I'm going to bring the queen here, looking to see whether or not we get a moment to greet their queen. surprised they didn't block the greeting but we'll go with the attack see if there's a queen exchange coming off well they're taking a long time so i don't think there is probably coming back probably doesn't want to block the bishop so coming here or there whichever we'll take it off the board though we have no problems with that they do seem to have blocked their rook so it looks like we can take this pawn with the knight. And they've moved a little bit quick, realising they may have made a mistake. This isn't a direct attack anywhere. And it does have a back, but the knight is protecting. So I don't think I'm going that way. I think we're probably going to come back the way we came. Which unfortunately is going to allow their bishop to x-ray through to our bishop. But we will be attacking this pawn. So let's bring the knight back. So I can picture... Oh, they're not doing that. So they've got a 2 on one on our bishop. Unfortunately, we don't want to allow that. So I'm going to have to bring the bishop back. We're still on their pawn. They look a little bit mad and it's probably just because they've lost that pawn i'm going to take because we're owning the file and the bishop has to move or else we get a back rank mate so it's attacking a pawn we've got defense so we can attack the pawn and attack the bishop and Knight again looking a little bit funky, but our rook doesn't have any defense on, so if their rook comes here, we'll be struggling for a defense of some sort. If we hit the knight, it's going to be funky business on our king, but if they forget themselves, we can take it off the board for free. Ah, not happening, but we do have a lovely x ray through to the rook, which means the rook is coming here. Which means we can potentially attack, but it's going to drop. It's going to be on a dark square. Maybe we can harass it a bit. So I'm going to attack the rook, attacking the pawn. Bring the bishop here. And it's coming to defend the pawn as well. But then we can go with a back ranker if that happens. So forget the bishop movement. Let's go for the back ranker. Ouch.